In this work, we present a perception-aware receding horizon navigation approach for micro-aerial vehicles. MAVs are versatile and agile. Researchers have demonstrated impressive aerobatics with MAVs, such as doing a flip, catching a flying ball, and flying through a narrow gap. Moreover, when we equip MAVs with onboard sensors, they have the potential to operate autonomously using only onboard sensing and computing. However, there are still many challenges before we can deploy such powerful platforms in the real world. The specific problem we are trying to tackle here is that real-world scenarios may impose serious perception challenges. For example, in this environment, the naive solution to go straight to the goal is not a good option because the MAV will go through textureless areas. Green paths close to the forest will be a better choice instead. To achieve such behavior, we propose to consider perception quality in a receding horizon fashion for navigation. Our approach uses two maps to represent the knowledge about the environment, a dense map for obstacles and an active map for localization. We first generate a library of motion primitives within a limited horizon, then evaluate each of the motion primitives for the progress to the goal, the collision risk, and the perception quality. Then we select the best one to execute in terms of these metrics. This process is repeated online as new information arrives. To evaluate the perception quality, we extract the active 3D points from a SLAM system. For each motion primitive, we sample several poses and calculate the Fisher information matrix for each pose. We then combine the information matrices for all the samples to calculate the perception quality for this motion primitive. We tested our approach in extensive simulations. In this scenario, our perception-aware method is able to prevent the MAV from entering a visually degraded area. We compared our proposed method with an equivalent one that does not consider the perception quality. Our method achieved a higher success rate and lower state estimation error. One interesting thing that we observed in our experiment is that obstacles act both as repellers due to the collision risk and attractors due to the active features on them. Our method is able to strike a balance between collision risk and state estimation uncertainty. We also validated our method in a real-world scenario. Our approach is able to command the MAV to follow a visually informative path to the goal. To summarize, we propose to combine perception quality, collision risk, and the progress to the goal in a receding horizon setting. Our approach enables better robustness and accuracy in environments with visually degraded areas.